Welcome to this episode of the Cornetto podcast. My name is Lene Langbelle. For most instruments, you can find technical guides and schools written by today's teachers. But the Cornetto, being a historical instrument, requires studies of original sources. When it comes to historical treatises, though, there is quite a lot of detailed information, especially about one technical aspect, articulation. Articulation is the language of the cornetto. 99% of the time I play articulated. It simply sounds better and fits the instrument. When playing with other instruments in smaller or bigger ensembles, or even solo, I have to adapt and change articulation all the time. To this comes, of course, the question of acoustics. Generally, you can say about articulation that it's all a question about strong and weak syllables, about accents and pronunciation, just like in the spoken language. Everything has to be audible and clear and have the right character. In Girolamo della Casa's Il vero modo di diminuire from 1584, you will find the exact syllables used for articulation, and the same goes for other treatises. I always find articulation a real challenge because it's so complex, but used with taste, it communicates in a very personal and direct way. Thanks for watching the Cornetto podcast.